Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of October 18th through the 26th. So what do we have for Leo? October 18th through the 26th. What do we have for Leo? Dagger, fear, worries, tense situation. So you're probably going to be in a tense situation this week. Oh, God. Vulture, depression, anxiety, worry that someone is against you. So, yay. That doesn't look pretty. So you're probably worried. Obviously, we have worry on both of these cards. So you're probably going to be feeling very, very worried this week. You may be in some sort of fearful state of mind. Uh, you obviously are involved in a tense situation. Uh, I think you're thinking about it a lot. You're fearful. Okay, we have an anxiety is fear. So there's definitely some fear this week. Uh, fear of, of who's against you, what they're going to do. Um, maybe watching your back. Ah, trapped in fear. Trapped in fear. So, yeah. You're going through some mental turmoil this week. Um, you might be in some sort of uncomfortable situation. Alright, looks like you are. Two of Wands reversed. Now, you, it feels like you're, you are restricting yourself. You're probably not wanting to leave much. Um, staying put, not really going anywhere, uh, maybe canceling things, uh, choosing to stay, to stay safe. You may be, you're feeling, you may feel like you're under, you know, you're under attack or you don't dare to go anywhere. It feels like you're trying to play it safe right now. Um, it's like you never know when somebody's going to show up and I think that's where your fear lies. Ooh, Strength reversed, so definitely fearful, extremely fearful. Um, you may be even, I mean, very depressed, uh, feeling sick, feeling unhealthy, uh, vulnerable. You, you know, there's lack of confidence here. Maybe you are, uh, this is in some sort of state of despair. It feels like you're stuck, you're trapped, you don't dare to leave, uh, you're feeling weak, you're feeling uh, fearful. There is definite fear here. Um, now, the Four of Pentacles is, is greed. You could be dealing with somebody that is a miser. This person is very greedy, very selfish, very stubborn. Uh, you must be afraid of this person. You are afraid of this person that is very, very stubborn. Okay, this Four of Pentacles is somebody that is... Uh, not willing to give an inch. So you got somebody here that is not willing to give. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be a, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Um, doesn't want to engage. It feels like there's there's ignoring here. I'm not interested. I'm not interested in anything that you have to offer me. I feel like you are you're dealing with with somebody that doesn't see doesn't see who you are. Um, somebody is ignoring an opportunity. They're, they are. They missed an opportunity. We have a very stubborn individual here that has really made you fearful. Um, yeah, extremely fearful. Yeah, you're scared. You are scared. I feel like you're scared to even leave. Um, whoever you are dealing with is having a lot of fun. They're not interested. They're not interested in what you have to offer. They're partying. They're they're socializing. They're uh, talking with other people. Uh, whoever you're dealing with is not interested in 
giving fully to having or any type of relationship with you. They they are interested in their money. They're interested in their work. They're interested in holding on to what they have and, and playing. So you're dealing with somebody who who is probably having a lot of fun with other people and that's why they're not interested in what you have to offer. This person may, whoever you're thinking about, uh, has their own community, right? They have, a, they have their own people and so they're not interested in what, what you, you know, are trying to give them. Um, seven of pentacles reversed now unrealistic dissatisfied you're very be you're being dissatisfied you because this is your energy you are dissatisfied that somebody doesn't see they don't they don't they're not interested um this is unrealistic there's no growth here there's no reason for you to keep putting putting energy into this you are, i think that your your fears are unrealistic i don't think that they're valid, okay? If you're fearful, I don't think that they're valid. I think whoever you're dealing with is not investing in you, okay? They're investing in other people. Yeah, they're not, they have no desire. They have no um, desire. They have no desire to... Put any effort into growing with you or to hurt to if you're fearful of them hurting you, I don't see that happening okay I feel like I feel like whoever this person is um you know I think that you're you have some sort of vision right or you think your your thoughts are saying that this person is is thinking about what they're gonna do to you or whatever I don't think that's the truth I don't think that's the truth I think that's your own thoughts. I think it's your own fears. I feel like you are, um, I think there's some sort of misunderstanding here. See, there's a lack of faith. There's a lack of trust. I feel like, uh, you're making, there's some sort, and this is right, I'm going with this. This is a poor judgment call. I feel like you are thinking that somebody is, headed in your direction, but I don't think they are. I don't think they are. I feel like whoever you're thinking about has no desire to put in any effort towards you because they got other people that they are having fun with, okay? Anyhow, I feel like you, I mean, with that fool card, that is uh, very, that's reckless, impulsive behavior, so it's interesting. Hanged man, struggling to let go. Thinking, thinking, thinking. You're thinking a lot. You're, you're, this is a period of time out. Thinking about what has happened. A new perspective is needed. Uh, restricting yourself. You need time. You need time. Take your time. Don't be in a hurry. It feels like you have a healing process that is needed. Because healing is needed. Okay? He and it's like you haven't healed. And, and it feels like you're trying to hurry and do something. This is reckless. In a hurry. Stupid. Just being honest. This is your side. No offense. This is the other person's side. I feel like you are in a hurry to... Um, get attached. Don't be in a hurry to get attached. You don't, there is no hurry to get attached. That's stupid. That's stupid. So, you know, I feel like you need to restrict yourself. I think that you need to go within. You need to heal. The fears that you have, I feel, are unwarranted. You may feel like you're not good enough. You may feel like you're inadequate. You may feel like you know, nobody wants you because you're not attached if you're single. That's not true, okay? We all have to go through periods of um, healing. And, you know, I had somebody comment on my last Leo reading uh, that they got separated. They got separated and they've healed for two months. What? Two months? You healed for two months? Do you, I mean, I, I don't know if this is for all of you or for this one person, but two months, that is not adequate healing, okay? And if you think it is, 
I'm here to inform you that it's not. Time out is needed, a time to reflect on everything that has happened, a time to reflect on what is making you so fearful. If you are in anxiety, if you are depressed, if you are fearful, then a period of healing is definitely needed because you shouldn't be getting into any type of relationship with anybody if you are in that kind of mindset. So anyway, I feel as though you need to take a time out. I think that there's reckless behavior behavior here. Wanting to be attached. Wanting to be attached. That's foolish. A time out is needed to heal. And I feel as though this week you are very fearful about a tense situation with somebody in your life. That doesn't want to communicate with you. This person uh, has weighed you down. This person has... I, I already did one Leo reading and I decided to do another one. They've ghosted you. They've abandoned you. They've neglected you. Uh, they've put you on the back burner. This is a disgrace. They've embarrassed you. Whoever this person is. You think this person is investing in you? That's your own thoughts. This person does not care about what you're doing. Stop investing in them. Stop in investing your thoughts in them. It feels like you keep thinking there's unfinished business with this person. It's not over. It's over. You must struggle through this. Let it go. You may feel like you are a victim. That's your own thoughts. Nobody is a victim here. You have the power within yourself to not let fear take over. I think you're doing a lot of thinking about what has happened. And I think you think about doing something stupid. Okay, because the full reverse is doing something foolish, doing something stupid. And you're, you know, you don't point the finger at the other person. Yeah, you think that they're going to do something stupid, but I think you're due too. There's weakness here. Doing something impulsive. All of a sudden. Anyhow, I feel, Leo, as though you need to let go. You need to let go completely. Drop, drop it. Drop whatever this is. Drop this person. Stop carrying this burden. This is a week of freeing yourself of that fear. Don't be worried. Whoever you are so worried about has new people. They're not interested in hurting you. Good luck.